What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Most Ball, and so today we're gonna be going over Spotlight Challenge number seven for the KG challenges. If you guys did not get past number six yet, I did upload a video last night. Please go ahead, go check it out. It's gonna help you guys out a lot. The method is pretty crazy, but a lot of people said it did work out for them. And also, before we continue, I just want to say that the best way to get these done is to evolve your KG. So after you get past like the first three challenges, you can start evolving him. I think the third one, you still need Emerald KG. I might be right or might be wrong or something like that, but it's somewhere around there. Second, third, just double check and then start evolving him. Start moving him up. I made a video on how to get the steals, the blocks, and basically evolve him to an Amethyst, to a Ruby. Now, I honestly don't want to get back into this game. Like, I don't want to play it again. So I'm just going to show you guys basically highlights from the stream, and I'm going to basically try to talk over it so you guys can see what I was doing. I actually got the 20 rebounds pretty much in two quarters. I had 19 at the end of the first half, and it's a very, very simple method. Hopefully, it's going to work out for you guys. So yeah, guys, basically just keep watching. Hopefully, it helps you guys out. Please make sure to hit that like button for me. It really helps me out a lot. Subscribe if you're new. Turn on the noties, and I will see you guys at the end of the video. So basically, what we're going to be talking about here is the team that I used. Pretty much same method as I used for game six. Kind of a bad team overall wise. Like nothing crazy. Nobody's that good. I did use artists. So the first thing I'm going to do when we get into the game is I actually switched Gilmore to the four and Garnett to the five. That way Garnett is under the basket. Next thing we do is we hit right on the D-pad. We go to rebounds, run in transition. I know I did that fast. So if you want to slow that down, go ahead and do so. But it's the same thing I showed off in the Wade Challenge. What it basically does is it lets the rest of your team run out when the rebounds, when like the ball goes up. And you can basically kind of be down there by yourself. So what you guys are going to be witnessing basically is me just controlling Garnett the whole time. I know sometimes they're going to score, but a lot of the time, not so much. This challenge is hard for a lot of people because they tell me Melo doesn't miss. They tell me Miller doesn't miss. They tell me this, this, and that. So the first thing you got to do is try to get the rebounds yourself. So try to get the rebounds as fast as possible. So in doing so, I'm going to show you guys how I was chucking the ball to try to get my own rebounds. And otherwise, you just kind of pray for the miss. They do play a lot worse. Like, I'm being for real. They do play a lot worse when you do lower, like, your teams overall. And a lot of the times, you just kind of have to hang around, try to get the rebounds. Right here, I noticed that basically I have a free reign. I take a bad shot on purpose to try to get my own rebounds. And that's basically the method that I was going around with. Right here, I'm actually texting on my phone and get a free rebound on my own. I know that's not going to happen often. But right now, we already got five rebounds. And you guys can see, I'm letting my team play defense and I'm grabbing the boards. I'm just rotating over. I'm making sure I'm there. I'm chucking really, really, really bad shots on purpose. And I'm just trying to basically dominate. I'm also scoring. It doesn't matter. You're trying to score too. You want the game close because you do have to win it. And you guys are going to see as soon as you get the takeover with your boy KG, which you get when you have a Ruby KG, he's just no, he's like literally unstoppable. And that's why you just got to chuck. So I chuck every time I get my takeover, I chuck as much as I can. And sometimes they just hit bad shots or good shots or whatever. You guys are going to see here, I was actually hitting some crazy shots to be honest. But most of the time with the takeover or even without, if you're just taking bad shots in general, you have a shot at getting the rebound. You're not always going to get it. It's not guaranteed. But the moment you get 20 rebounds is the moment you can start playing the game the right way. So you're basically depending on two different things. You're depending on them missing and you missing. So the way I thought was easier was to basically depend on yourself and look at this shot right here. Bang, yo. I was so irritated that that went in because I really had the step. If you actually look at it back, I literally took this because I knew KG was beating him up the court. You see it right there. That's usually what I wait for. KG beats him. I hit it from the P in Pepsi. Literally drills it. And as you guys know, I'm streaming on Twitch at this moment. Like I was streaming doing this live. And if you guys don't follow me on Twitch, I don't know what you're doing. But basically, look at this shot, man. That's Damian Lillard icing on the cake range. Like look at that. Closed out. All that and look at my mellow missing for me man mellow missing for me you can't ask for anything more I'm shooting with Ferguson all the time look 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 sometimes you're gonna get it sometimes you're not if you don't get it don't worry about it you'll get it in other ways like that rebound I had no business getting right there but I got it anyway and I usually wait till I can control KG 
to let him come by and grab his own rebound. And we're killing this challenge. I told you, I was killing it. Look at this, bro. Look at this. Takeover KG is a different beast. So make sure you got Ruby KG. It will definitely help you out if you do. If you have the Amethyst one, it doesn't matter that he doesn't have rebounding takeover. He's still an absolute stud, absolute beast. And honestly, sometimes you're just going to get your rebound stolen. It happens to the best of us. But try to be in position to do what you got to do. Me just going up for an offensive basket right there actually got me my own rebound. And look at this. Look at this, man. I'm killing the rebound game, man. No one can stop me right now. I'm on a whole different level. That's all I got to say. Sometimes you're going to miss a rebound here and there. Sometimes that happens. It happens to the best of us. So you're going to have to do the best to your ability to just stay patient and be where you got to be. And I got lucky. 19! I was a little hyped. I'm not going to lie. I had 19 at half. My boy KG needed a break. Look at him, bro. He got to rest. And you guys see right there, someone followed me on Twitch. Mm, I think that means you guys should be doing the same thing. Shout out to J-Rob for following me on Twitch at this exact moment when KG just chilling. So there's a little link down below for Twitch. Make sure you click on it or you go ahead and type most bowling. And once you do that, you're going to hit that heart button to follow me. Turn on the notifications. We stream every day. And you already know, KG 20 and 19 monster game. I ended up letting him sit out the whole third quarter and just put him in in the fourth to get the last rebound. I was one rebound short, so it was easy money from there. But yeah, guys, that's all it is, man. That's all you had to do to get that done, pretty much. I hope it works out for you. Make sure you let me know down low if it does. Next challenge is you need 32 points. Match KG's 32 and a win. Probably playing a good team. Five minutes all-star. It's going to be not too bad. Let me know what other challenges I'm going to need to focus on as we move forward. If anyone's stuck on anything else. I know the big two are six and seven for sure. I hope you guys get through them. I hope my videos do help. That's the main reason for them. With all that said though, it's been your boy Mosbowen. I will be seeing you guys later and bowling out.